want to manage your own portfolio, you need conviction. You need high-quality companies that you believe in so that when everyone else is panicking like they were in the fourth quarter of last year, you can be opportunistic. Take Kramer Fave 5 Below, the retail chain where everything costs 5 bucks or less. These stores have a terrific feel to them. I love going to them. And more importantly, they're fueling the kind of regional to national growth story that tends to produce monster multi-year gains. So when 5 Below sold off hard in the fourth quarter, dragged down by trade war worries and the general market may let up wide may less, my travel trust pounced. We figured we wouldn't get a better chance to buy this one. And sure enough, 5 Below bottomed about a week later. And since then, it's given us a 40% plus gain. And I've been recommending it for, on the show for years. And hey, if you were still worried about this one at the end of March, come report a real good quarter, proving that Five Below is back, or it would be black, except for it never really left. And I think it's got a lot more upside over many years, but do not take it from me. Let's check in with Joel Anderson, the bankable president and CEO of Five Below, to learn more about the quarter and what's fueling this tremendous regional and national growth story. Mr. Anderson, welcome back to Man Money. Good to see you, Bart. Have a seat. Thanks, Jim. Good to see, see you. Yeah, good, you tell good you, to be back. Yeah, Joel, uh, his company is located in the old Lip Brothers building, a cast iron building in Philadelphia where my mom works, so it's still near and dear every time I go by where you are. I want to talk longer term. Okay. I feel that when I see a store that works, I think about the great Peter Lynch at Magellan who said, if you think a store works in your area and you think it can work in other areas, you've got a, a chain that can grow for years. Does Five Below work in every area you put one? You know, it's amazing, Jim. We finished the year at 750 stores. We've shared with everybody that we believe there's 2,500 plus in the United States. So we're barely over a third of the way. We entered California two years ago. In fact, just a few weeks ago, we went into Iowa and Nebraska. So look, it's been working on the coast and now it's working in the middle of the country. So we absolutely feel there's a runway across the entire United States. Now, there is a dichotomy going on in real estate. There sure. are stores that you don't want in the mall, and there are stores that you want. I sense that Five Below is one that the landlords want. <laughs> well, look, we want to be in healthy, vibrant malls yeah. as much as landlords need healthy, vibrant retailers. And what's great about our customer is we bring young, vibrant, lots of footsteps. And so, it's a win-win for both us and the landlords. I find when I, when I go to your place, I can't believe that the stuff costs five bucks. Uh, I mean, it should be much more to me. There's all sorts of things that I always think are uh, that you're taking a beating on. That's how you feel when you go to Five Below? Yes. How are you able to, to source like this so that you actually make a profit? Well, look, we, we got a great merchandising team. In fact, uh, a whole group of them are overseas right now. And so we get as close to the factory as possible. And in fact, some of the product we have up here right now is will all be in the store starting on Monday. So you go in our stores today, it's all full of Easter. Right. And starting Monday, it really turns over and, you know, you're going to start to see, you know, towels and, and string lights and just lots of great spring product here. And not to mention slime. Right. Slime's well, been slime a great trend for almost two years now. Incredible. And incredible. And it's just about making it fun. That one's flarp, so right. it's got fun noises. And, you know, we love, we love slime. All right. So, Joe, you say the sort you're going where you have to go. So you got to talk to us about China. I mean, I know that I mean, we once joked about $5.50. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, we're still sourcing well. Uh, Absolutely. Really? You know, sourcing well. You know, this is made in India. Uh, okay. You know, we've got our, our towels are come from India. Uh, T-shirts from Honduras. So we're, we're kind of all over the world where we need to be. And certainly China is one uh, country we source from. But we're, we're feeling really good about all the countries. All right. So what's with this 10 below? <laughs> Look, at the end of the day, 5 below and what we mean to our customer yep. is we deliver a great customer experience right. in a treasure hunt environment that delivers value. Right. 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 And so no, it's true. what it's 10 is. below is, is about more value. So the, the areas we've been testing in is the, the feedback from the customer is, oh, my gosh, that's yeah. incredible value. And so what will be consistent in whether you're in five below or anything priced above that will be about value. You're telling me there could be a second big concept here. <laughs> well, listen, let's uh, not put the cart before the horse. We love Five Below. Right. As I said to you, we've only got 750 open, and we are fully focused on that. But we continue to innovate, and that's one of the areas we're innovating and testing higher price points. All right, so let's be a little skeptical here. Uh, 
you had to benefit from the closing of Toys R Us. What happens when you anniversary all the goodwill that Toys R Us gave you in closing? You know, I was with you about a year ago. Yes, you were. And the, all the concerns was, how do we anniversary the spinners from 17? <laughs> you're so right. right. You're so right. Now you're asking me, how am I going to anniversary hey, the Hey, what? I've endorsed you the whole time. I mean, <laughs> you got to let me have some school. You want me to, I mean, what, are you the next Bed Bath & Beyond? What do you want me to say to you? Uh, what I want you to say is, when our customers discover Five Below, they love what they see. And so if it takes a trend to discover us, like it was spinners in 17, right. toys in 18, they get in, they like what they see, and they come back. So those customers that discovered us in holiday for toys are now coming in for spring product. And they've been in there for Easter products. So it just it exposes more people to the brand. I know you've been wowing people. What does the wow mean in Philadelphia? <laughs> well, in Philadelphia, it means an amazing headquarters. You know, we have record unemployment. We've got Bryce Harper now. Uh, so clearly, you can come in our stores and and get all the Harper product you need. And uh, it just shows you that we're always on trend. Do uh, are you out them at the uh, at the Morgan at the J.P. Morgan conference? Yes, we did. Thank uh, you. We're talking about the consumer is not necessarily uh, spending everywhere but spending on value. Is that something that you see? That's like a big trend, what, post the Great Recession? Why are people still hung up on value? In the old days, we used to start getting people to spend more. Yeah. Look, uh, we just completed 13 consecutive years of positive comps. It's unbelievable. And, you know, of course, on our last earnings call, we guided to a 14th consecutive year. So value is really done well. Uh, and I think what we do special in value is we deliver it with a great customer experience. Right. And that treasure hunt environment, mm -hmm. just you're constantly coming in to try new things, and find I, new things. And I know so many people worried about the tariffs. It's just yeah. not a factor, huh? You know, I think the tariffs are, you know, pretty much uh, calmed down right. on both sides. I think uh, both countries have realized we need a calming and a cooling off, and we're in a good spot there. Well, you've done a great job, and uh, you make Philadelphia proud. I'm sorry to inject hometown pride, yeah. but we don't have a lot of companies where we're from, except for parent company of that kind of thing. All right, that I want to thank Joel Anderson, president and CEO of Five Below. My Chapel Trust owns it. It's been a huge win. We're not getting rid of it. Man, money's back into the break. Booyah! Jim Cramer here from Mad Money. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube. Click here to subscribe and get the jump on my exclusives with CEOs, plus market news, investing advice, and a whole lot more.